Okay, good morning, good evening, good everywhere where you are. As you can see on my clock right here, right there, it's 7.04 a.m. That's when I like to do these videos. But this video here is, discusses um, M5, discussion book 5, cloud storage, okay? So basically what you have to do, they give you a scenario where you left your flash drive in the college computer lab and lost all your assignments. Now you have to redo all your work, but you heard of cloud storage such as Office 365, OneDrive, and Google Drive, and Dropbox from your friend. So what you need to do is research these three. Office 365, OneDrive, Google Drive, and Dropbox. Okay? Then you're going to use your Faytech Google student email account to use Google Docs and you're going to document the following information for each service okay that is right there so um, I'm going to show you how to do that okay so the very first thing you want to do is you want to open up your your student email okay alright so I'm going to go here and um, I'm just going to open up. I do have a student email. Let's see, can I open it? If it doesn't open it, oh, there it is. Okay, once you open your student email, okay, over here to the right are your Google Apps. This is where you will find Google Docs. So I'm going to click that Google App right here. And I'm going to open up Google Docs, which is indicated by that icon right there. Okay now I'm just gonna create a blank document okay blank document it's gonna look just like for the most part Microsoft Word it's not Microsoft Word it's Google Docs so the very first thing I'm gonna do starting from the top is I'm gonna give this sucker a name and what better name to call it other than M5 D5 cloud storage okay so I'm gonna call it M5 D5 cloud storage that is and I'm probably gonna put my last name okay now when you insert when you save when you put anything on this document it saves automatically okay we'll talk a little bit about that more if necessary okay so that's what I'm gonna do we saved it first so the next thing I'm gonna do is I'm gonna go here and I'm gonna just copy the assignment okay I'm gonna copy the assignment right there I select all those items right there I use I can right click and copy it right there or I can use the shortcut control C okay now that it's copied I'm gonna insert that into my Google Docs by going control V or you could right click and go paste okay so this is the assignment so you're gonna research three of those right there those three right there now how do you research them very good I'm glad you asked all you have to do is um, for example I'm gonna copy that right there that's one of the first questions right there and I'm just gonna open up a new browser I'm gonna paste it in right there what is the price for um, what is the price for Google Docs or oh, um, 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 OneDrive I can't type O N E D R I V E cloud service let's see what it says there it is right there okay so you get all your information um, from right there then you of course you would do um, Google Docs you would just type Google Docs in here etc etc okay so you answer all your information right there okay alright so now what you have to do is you have to create a shared link from this document that you have pasted all of the correct information in there okay how do you do that we go over here to the word share okay and right here okay you need to make sure if I click that link right there on the link so let me 
click right there on the link you need to make sure that it is shared with everyone with the link if you share it if you make it private restrict it then only the people that you share it with for example doctor only those people will have access to it and you can give them different privileges if you want them to just be able to view it bam if you want them to be able to comment on it if you want them to be able to go in and make changes on it you can select one of those through it there okay but that's not what we want to do no we want to share with everybody so we're going to click this right there where it says get link we're going to click that right there and we're going to drop this box down click the arrow for the drop down and we want it to share with everyone lotta dotted and everybody okay then we're going to go here and copy that link control c or hit copy right there and done okay so now this link is copied okay anything you put on this link anything you share on this link anytime you do it when they click your shared link it will go to you the new changes okay so now we're going to go to blackboard and we're going to now we're getting ready to post our um, information okay so we go to blackboard we click this icon here we go to the very top where it says create thread okay we already know that this is DB5 and your last name okay now right here I'm gonna type the word attached is my assignment okay attached is my assignment now I'm gonna select these words right here attached are my assignment and I'm gonna click the link the the insert link button right there I click that link and I'm gonna go control V and it's going to paste the link that you attached from Google Docs. Okay, now you can uh, give it a title, my link, and you can open in current window or new window, your choice. If you open in the current window, it opens right there in Blackboard. If you open in a new window, it takes you out of Blackboard. So I'm going to hit save and then I'm going to hit submit and bam that is so now when I go to open it up which is what your classmates will see that's what they see right there when they click that link right there let's see what happens bam it takes them to Google Docs I hope that helps with assignment M5, D5, Cloud Storage. This is yours truly, Dr. Willie Lockett, with another helpful computer tip for CIS 110.